I hope that my journey will help encourage other young mothers to return to the workforce and take on the challenge. I'm Natalie Ford, I'm the manager at Rockingham Dialysis Clinic which is based in Western Australia. I'm a UK trained nurse, I started my career in orthopaedic nursing where I spent two years of my career. I then moved to renal nursing where I spent five years in England in a dialysis renal based setting. I moved to Australia with my family eight years ago and I've spent that whole eight years with Fresenius. I spent four and a half years in the Spearwood Clinic as a clinical nurse and I've been at the Rockingham Dialysis Clinic as their manager for the last three years. Outside of work, I'm married, I've got three young children. My oldest is Josh, he's 11. I've got Zach who is six and then I have a three-year-old daughter called Georgia. Eight years ago, we moved to Australia. We actually relocated in March 2013. I was lucky enough to have a job when I arrived in the country and I was based in the Midland Dialysis Clinic. I approached the manager at Spearwood and she was looking for a clinical nurse. So I decided to do some shifts at the Spearwood Clinic and then within the two weeks I actually got the CM position at Spearwood and then I moved there permanently. I spent four and a half years at the Spearwood Dialysis Clinic and I was on maternity leave with my third child, my daughter Georgia, when the position for Rockingham actually came up. I wasn't sure whether it was the right time for me to go for this job, but I do know these positions are really few and far between, so I decided to go for it. I thought at the very least it'd be a really good interview experience. I never actually thought that I would get the job. And now, three years on, I'm really proud of the work that I've achieved in the clinic so far. When I first heard about this job opportunity, I knew I wanted the challenge. I was really concerned about the timing. I knew that it would be a huge sacrifice on my family and the time that I would get to spend with the children. It was actually my husband in the end who told me to just go for it. He said, whatever it takes, we'll make it work. I overcame my hesitancies by deciding that I had nothing to lose. I knew I had the qualifications and I knew that I had the experience to go for the job. I'm also really lucky that I have a great support network behind me. After the interview, I only had about 24 hours to make my decision. The job was offered to me right at the end of November with a start date of the 1st of December. So within 24 hours, I was in the office, I had my uniform on and I was ready to go. I'm also really lucky that I had the support of my previous manager. She was the one who really encouraged and supported me throughout the whole process. I'm really grateful for the amazing team that work here at the Rockingham Dialysis Clinic. They had a really busy couple of years when I first took the position. We had two different sets of external auditing that we had to get through. There was a lot of new processes, procedures, policies that had to be learned. I manage my work-life balance by saying when I come to work, I come to work for a holiday. I have found that since taking on this role, working full-time and being a manager, that I appreciate the time that I have with my husband and my children. I feel like we have more quality time together. Earlier on in my career, I wish I'd known to believe in myself. You can do more than you think. You just need to put yourself out there because opportunities won't just come to you. I think it's really important to support young women in the workplace and really support them to grow. I've spent time over the years really getting to know my staff and I understand that there's more to them than what I see at work and that they all have families at home. The key message that I would like to deliver is that you can make a difference. You can have a career and you can have a family, but don't lose yourself along the way. I work hard to maintain a healthy work lifestyle balance and I make sure that I take time out to do the things that I enjoy. I hope that my journey will help encourage other young mums to return to the workforce and take on the challenge.